I mean, dude, this is insane. Okay? This shop, it's, it's literally insane. If you haven't seen it, I mean, finally, and I shouldn't even say finally, it hasn't even been that long since I've known that she existed. Festival Phaedra is back in the Fortnite item shop. Oh my Lanta, that's right, baby, baby Yaga. I almost think, I always think of baby Yoda. People are low key going crazy for this skin, dude. We gotta kind of talk about it. Bro, those warts, they got cream for that. Chill, okay? Um, confirm ghetto Lego confirms. I actually kind of like the ghetto Lego. It's not bad. Uh, what is going on? Oh, I, I'm just so lost for words. I was thinking about Alexa. I'm not going to lie. I'm not going to lie. That's what I have fired up right here. I'm, I'm worried that my, my career that's just started as a Fortnite reviewer may be over because what's the point? of buying or wearing any other skin after this comes out we're going to talk about it before we do before we do a deep dive into the fortnite item shop oh my lanta i need this skin so bad before we do a uh, in-depth look into the fortnite item shop today and check out mephisto I feel like we're a little hot that's fine though this is a this is a small production here. This is a that's right one man band. Okay, you know how we do it, raw and uncut, baby. This is what we're doing right now. This is called the yes OCD check. All right, display capture on, camera on, recording on, audio is moving up and down. It's it's kind of peaking. See how it's hitting the red right there. So we're gonna back it down a little bit. Check, 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 check. Two, 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 one, two, two, two. That's good, right there. Uh, recording on, display capture on. You know, this is it, bro. It's just me and you. That's all we need. No team. No, no, you know. Uh, the other thing we got to do, though, is I have to ask you for a favor, okay? It's not, uh, I'm not asking you for money. I'm not uh, asking you for any weird uh, paid subscriptions. The only thing I ask from you is that you please use my supportive creator code. Uh, you can do this on any console, Xbox One, Xbox Series S, whatever, PS4, PS5, Switch, PC, the browser version of the item shop, doesn't matter. Hit the support a creator button, uh, put my code in quantum camper, all one word, okay, Q-U-A-N-T-U-M-C-A-M-P-E-R, doesn't matter if it's capitalized or not, put that in, hit search, look for the green check mark, you're done, okay, and I don't know if you knew, but what is the definition of Fortnite? That's right, 14 days. The actual word Fortnite means 14 days. And coincidentally, the support of creator code auto refreshes every Fortnite. So do me a favor, even if you put it in before, uh, make sure it's still in there, okay? If you don't see it, no worries. Just put it in one more time and we're good to go for the next Fortnite. There you go. All right, let's get into this Mephisto. Okay, so you know how I always say, I, I, I don't ever, I try not to talk any smack about skins. I literally learned my lesson again yesterday. We were looking at some of the survey skins and there was like a tree guy. And I was like, bro, who would freaking buy that tree guy? Wow. And then I look down because I have um, cause we were streaming live yesterday <laughs> and I have my phone like right here and it's like right here and I'm looking. That's how I read the comments. And so I'm like, who would buy that skin? And I look down. Borderline Pesa was like, bro, the tree guy's so sick. I'm like, I broke my own rule, dude. My bad. Borderline. Not just because a skin isn't for me for you. Or for me, it doesn't mean that it's not good. Okay. Um, so like that's what's going on with with so Mephisto is like objectively a great skin. Like they they knocked it out of the park, dude. The coloring looks good. I and 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 it's gonna sound weird, but I feel like you know the uh, because he is all red. 
picking a certain exact shade of red for this character was probably, I guarantee you, they had weeks of discussion of how red, what exact like red color he should be. And I think it looks great. I don't think it's too too red. I think whatever this shade of red that Mephisto is, is perfect. The design looks great. Everything. I did hear from Cameron, shout out Cameron Bradley, that this thing right here that's part of this flap or whatever you call it part of his uh his outfit that kind of gets a little wonky sometimes where you're doing emotes that's the only thing that he said is um kind of like a negative about the skin okay so i could see that i could see that when you're dancing and moving around that this kind of you know might not animate correctly but all in all he said it's really good and looks super clean um like this design looks great the skull right there the hair i mean everything um and now that i'm actually like looking at it, i'm like this actually is real i might actually run this um and the this the okay yeah you can see the cloth and this is just medium graphics too so um if you're doing like a ps5 or like you know high or epic graphics it's gonna look even better now that i'm actually like really looking at it it, it looks really good i probably would run it when's he here tell 10 19 so it's 10 12 uh so you got literally a week i may pick them up actually <laughs> i was gonna i was gonna do this whole thing about like you know he's really good objectively but it's just not for me but now that i'm like really looking at him he is super cool and and he's got a he's got a clean back so it's gonna look good for back blings okay he does come with a cape and the cape does look clean the cape looks actually look at the dis, look at the detail on the cape is actually wild, bro. That's really good. This is a good cape, and I feel like it flows nicely to where you can see still see the uh, you could still see the the skin, and it's got this cool skull on it. So knocked it out of the park. I'm not a huge um, cape fan, but I think that one's really good. Very nice Lego. Uh, the demon's hand pickaxe is sick. This is like legitimately good. And then the big selling point for me, like this is crazy to say, but like, dude, the rap, the rap is wild, bro. Look at that. It's animated and reactive. Look how sick that is, dude. And I bet you this will look good on one of the wrap uh, skins, too. It's so good. If anything, I would I would recommend... Uh, I would recommend uh, picking just the wrap up. I gifted it to somebody, too. Shout out. You know, I know you're going to like it. it. It's sick. That that wrap, I might just get the wrap, honestly. Um... So, yeah, let me know in the comments what you think about Mephisto. I think he's uh, an insanely solid design. They knocked it out of the park. No doubt about it. Um, and it just kind of comes down to, is that a skin that you would rock? You know? So, I think that's important to always to always recognize. You can, you can say a skin is cool and designed well, but maybe you're just, you know, it's not something you would be into. Um, but now that I'm, like, really looking at it, I'm like, I think I actually, I think I might actually be into that. Uh, we'll see. There's so much in the shop right now. It's actually insane. OCD check. Recording on, display capture on. We're good. One more time. It's getting crazy, dude. Did you guys watch the live yesterday? It was so much fun. I've got a freaking, <laughs> I got a clip. I'm going to, I'm going to be clipping some stuff from it. It was a lot of fun, dude. Shout out Luffy, shout out Snazzy Blocks, uh, shout out Buster Buka, uh, shout out Jamie OK, shout out everyone in the in the chat, Wayne, Dead Nightmare, everyone, bro. Um, Model Four, pathetic person, everyone who I'm sorry if I'm not specifically naming you, Cold Zone 999. Um, don't feel left out just because I'm not saying your name. I have brain damage. I legitimately am always uh, sleep deprived. So don't get butt hurt. 
don't get upset if I didn't just say your name. But thank you everyone for who watched it. Um, what we're we gonna do? Oh yeah, I was gonna tell you that we also have the wheel of names loaded up. Ninety five names here. Okay, so we're gonna we're gonna do the drawing on that. Everyone's caught up. Everyone's been paid out. We uh, I sent what black uh, jack for Oz, Blackjack for Oz. They were super stoked. They said they were short on V-Bucks and um, that was really going to help them out. So they're, they're, I always love to hear that. Um, like a, a regular viewer and commenter and somebody who needed the V-Bucks. So it was just a win-win across the board. I love it. Honestly, I'm happy when anyone wins. Doesn't matter, you know, you, you're, you participated in the contest. So it's, you know, but uh, so it's your right to win when you do. But that being said, uh, I love it when somebody, uh, you know, it's a little more special when it's uh, a regular commenter. So check out the live. OK, you can watch the playback of it if you weren't a part of it. I know it was late. So a lot of you, uh, you know, weren't able to uh, stay up for it. I mean, we uh, I, I think I went live from like 11.30 a.m. to like 4. So right here, just uh, go to my YouTube page, go to the live tab, and then you can go to Fort Nightmares Live. Yeah, four-hour stream. So uh, we the, the first half of it is uh, was like right after downtime. This is so fun, dude. Honestly, I think I prefer doing the, the setup of like the live where I, where we're just chatting and I can fully focus on the chat and go f straight up back and forth with you guys. We're looking up skins. We're looking up the, uh, the leaks and everything and, and, and all that. Um, it's such a vibe and it's so cool. I love that. Um, and then the second half <clears throat> is, uh, is playing some games. Um, my performance actually wasn't super, super bad. We were kind of hitting around the 30 to 60 frames per second. Uh, but that even being said, it was uh, it was still a little choppy. It was still a little hard for me to play. Um, so I mean, I'm admittedly not good at this game, but it's even harder when I'm streaming and my it's lagging and stuff. So there's some pretty bad plays where I think I may have gotten taken out by a uh, by a bot. I don't think I don't think it was a bot. I think it was just a very underskilled player. But go ahead and watch that. I'm gonna show you a little. I'm gonna show you a little clip later. It's so funny, dude. Um, but how are you liking the uh, the update so far? It's it's just it's insane, dude. Uh, I want to talk about the update later on, but um, yeah, I just wanted to make sure you guys know about that live replay. Um, it's so cool. You can watch our like everyone's live reaction to to seeing because we literally were updating our consoles and and uh, PCs and stuff all at the same time, and then we all you know experienced it f for the first time together. It was super. It was special. Uh, Pumpkin King and Sally, dude, so freaking good. I mean, I can't say enough good things about this. This, uh, I, I know it's expensive. Um, what is it, thirty four hundred? Thirty four hundred. But you get the Pumpkin King skin, which is very skinny in game, by the way. Like his frame is just wildly skinny. But that being said, I think it looks really good in game. Um, he, I'm stoked to have like a pumpkin themed, uh, skin finally, like the Lego looks really good. Uh, and then Sally, forget about it, bro. And we were talking about it in the, in the stream. Like she might low key be like OG edgy girl. You know what I mean? Uh, she's so cool, dude. Honestly, it's so, and, and the hair, I just love the like super long hair. Uh, and the hair looks so good in game. It's crazy, dude. Like we were just freaking out. Like it was several times we were just like, wow, Sally looks so good, dude. Like they just absolutely knocked it out of the park with her. Um, I did upload raw, uh, not raw, but like um, just like a no commentary gameplay on my uh, YouTube channel. If you want to check that out. Um, so it's just go to, it's my most recent video after you see this, it'll be the second most, but just look Sally gameplay. Um, 
I just uh, I played a few games with high gra- high graphics on. I was getting some pretty decent um, performance last night. And oh, wa- watch the opening shot right here, dude. This is just whoa, chill, 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 chill. Look at this right here. The changes on the map are actually insane, dude. Right here, look at that. How cool is that shot right there? Um, cool, dude. Cor- did you know? Did you you want to know something crazy? Did you know that Firefox nerfs the performance of uh, YouTube? Isn't that crazy? They specific so that stutter you just watched. They implement that in there because they want you to use uh, Google Chrome. So if you if you watch YouTube on Firefox, which is what I'm using, they specifically nerf the performance of YouTube on Firefox. It's been proven to make you switch over to Google Chrome. It's infuriating. Because I have fast internet. I have a good, I have a mid to like high mid tier machine and they, and YouTube lags like crazy on Firefox. It drives me insane, dude. It makes me touch the darkness right now. I'm, I'm kind of, everything's fine. I get to play this game. I'm talking to you. We're having a great time. We had a great live. Oh my Atlanta. <sighs> but you can't use plugins on Google Chrome. Hear me out, bro. How good is that shot though? How are you guys liking the updates, dude? This is what we're talking about. Okay, I know it's a little loud. We're gonna turn it down here. Um, the chainsaw is actually insane. Look at this. Wham! It's so fu- it's so fun. Um, th- we were talking about this. The changes to the map. This feels like a new season. This isn't just a freaking mini like uh, a mini update. Like new the giant statue has a freaking pumpkin head finally they have a chest and um the thing to jump off of it up there um i mean look dude there's like two two major new pois okay or one new poi and a bunch of them have been dressed up and changed a little bit um the river is is red now instead of green the train looks so sick bro Okay, there's like tons of new mythics, tons of new NPCs like Billy, which is low key. We're going to show you a clip from about Billy, how insane Billy is, the NPC Billy, um, how we almost uh, like the Billy NPC almost was a squad wipe. They almost squ- <laughs> wiped the whole squad, dude. So, yeah, this is uh, this is Sally. Sally is just so clean in game, dude. Um. I think there's a there's a clip of the train. The train is so sick. If you guys haven't played yet, oh yeah, the emo is so good too. Um, oh, there's the train right there. Look at how freaking rad that is, dude. Are you kidding me right now? Oh, not to mention there's a really fun LTM that's got like save the world vibes. We played that. We won a match yesterday. Um, this is a, this is a new season, dude. And I and I was watching. Uh, I think it was like Courage. I, I caught a little bit of his stream today. He said this exact same thing that we were talking about yesterday. Because he was like, dude, this is a new season, bro. It's wild. And, and uh, you know, a lot of the OG players that were in the chat yesterday that have been around since Chapter 1, they were like, this is the best uh, Fortnite Mirrors update that's happened since the very first one. I guess the first one they cooked with big time. But like... They were like, this is the best one in since the very first one. Uh, it's phenomenal. And, bro, um, look at this. There is amazing giveaways, dude. So you, so you guys got to know about this. Go to your quests. Go to Fort Nightmares. Okay, all of this, all of this stuff is free, bro. All of this right here. You got this rad bat guitar, okay? Inspect items, here we go. You got this rad, the Fangler, okay? 
I just got this today. Then we got this really, really cool um, back bling. This is free, dude. Cool artwork. Decent banner. We got the uh, Contrail Jacko Drift. Oh, that's actually cool. I like that. And then I'm really excited about this. Um, this is a uh, reskin of Scully that's so good, dude. Fiendish Wand. This is this this is gonna get sweaty. This is really good. This is free, dude. Okay. Goldrin Chill or Cauldron Chill. How fun is that, dude? How good is she, dude? She looks so nice. Uh, we got the Fortnite Mirrors artwork. And then, last but not least, the great Scarecrow glider, bro. How good is that? Honestly. This is crazy, dude. And then Horde Rush. Um... You guys got to play Horde Rush too. It's really fun. It's it's good with friends too. We were doing it in the in the um, stream. Uh, so yeah, so start banging these out. Um, they're gonna slowly drip out um, the quests. So make sure you stay on top of these too. Okay. Um, oh, it looks like oh they got some. Oh wait, do they have festival stuff too? Um, we might have to check that out right now. Let's go to festival. See if the, the, are they doing any festival giveaways? I actually literally have not even uh, checked this. So we're gonna we'll do it live. Um, talk to Punk while backstage. I don't know. Maybe it's just uh, some stuff to just uh, grind extra XP. So it doesn't look like there's any specific. Um, new giveaways for a uh, festival but regardless um oh no i do not want to play <laughs> it's just crazy dude the update's actually insane let's get back to the shop so yeah i i i got the whole pumpkin king and sally um bundle hopefully jack skellington uh comes back Oh, about the giveaways too, like, uh, people in the chat were like complaining, like, there's no free skin, which, come on guys, how many times do we have to go over this? Like, don't worry about what you don't have, focus on what you do have, okay? This, that's just like typical, annoying Fortnite complaining stuff. You know what? You guys might, some, some people might get blocked for that, dude. It's just so outrageous. How many times do we have to go over it, dude? Like, you can have this entire page of giveaways that are legitimate, okay? That's a glider I would pay for. I know you would. And I know you would for sure pay 800 for this fiendish wand. And it's free. And you're still like, <laughs> but I wanted to skin for free. <laughs> Shut up, bro. Oh my gosh, see? <sighs> Let's get, we gotta get rid of this darkness, dude. That's what happens, bro. That's how it does, it, it touched me right now. Okay, positive vibes in, dude. Positive energy, negative energy out. <sighs> do it with me, positive, we're gonna do two more, okay? Positive energy in. Negative energy out. <sighs> one more, one more, do it with me, okay? Positive energy in. <sighs> Hold it. Negative energy out. We are grateful for all of the free giveaways that we get in this spooky season. Thank you, Epic. Thank you, Fortnite. These are sick, bro. We don't even... Let's not worry about any, any of that. We are grateful for this amazing stuff that we have. Even if you can't... I, and I get it. Times are tough, dude. Even if you can't afford anything in the shop right now. Got some amazing giveaways for you, okay? So uh, let's focus on that, dude. And you know what? You can't afford it? Don't worry. We got freaking giveaways, bruh. Not only do we have the, you know, 1,000 V-Bucks we're giving away daily. We have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven more. And then I'm going to go uh, pick.
pick up some more tomorrow because I got to get the, uh, we get the big, we have the big contest coming up, okay? The small contest, this is going to be insane, dude. The small photography contest ends tomorrow, okay? So you have to have your submissions in by 5 p.m. tomorrow. Okay? And specifically, you have to go to Zephyrus and take a photo uh, at Zephyrus, specifically at the pumpkin patch, okay? Um, and it's not based on merit. It's not based on like, you know, whose photo is the best. It's literally just participation. I wanted you, I wanted to give a head start to the community here uh, before the actual contest starts because it's going to be, bro... At least it's it's going to be at least twenty eight hundred V bucks for the winner for the for the main photography contest, and you're getting your photo in Zephyrus. All right. So I'm like, hey guys, you got to warm up here, okay? And we're opening it to the public. It's going to be posted, blasted on Twitter. You know, Ed Meyer's got a ton of followers, um, so it's going to get. It's going to be a fierce competition. That's why I was like, okay, we got to do a mini event for the community here. Just kind of, so you guys, you're getting a, you're getting a head start, okay? So, and we're, we have some really good submissions, okay? Plushy, JC, uh, Pathetic Person, Gentle Squirrel coming in, all right? Um, Cam actually, oh, Cam, you know what's crazy? Cam submitted some really good photos here, and then specifically this one, I've always kind of been like on the edge with Festival Lace, and then... He sent these, uh, the photography pictures of Festival Ace. I was like, dude, why did I always pass on her? She's so nice. And uh, I was like, I got to I gotta get her next time she comes into the shop. And guess what? She's here today. So shout out Cam Bradley. Um, so this small contest that ends tomorrow that we will be doing the drawing for on the episode tomorrow, uh, it's just based on participation. When you submit your photo in this thread here, it specifically has to be in this thread, um, photo taken at the pumpkin patch in Zephyrus. Uh, when you do that, you'll get your name on a bonus spin. Okay, so we're just going to do a spin for all the participants. doesn't matter, you know, the quote-unquote level, you know, how good or not good... Uh, your photo is oh i haven't even seen these ones shout out retro um ooh, when is patch coming back i want patch so bad oh that's rad i like that um so yeah so you so if you submitted a photo um if you have not you have until 5 p.m tomorrow okay just so you know what's going on and then um so i i did end up giving a couple extra away so we're gonna have more than seven more i think we'll be at like nine i might buy three more 1000 v buck cards to just continue giving away each day and then we're going to do at least 2800 uh for the main winner i might even do 5000 we'll see because i want it to be big and then we'll do a 1000 v buck uh, runner up it's gonna be fun dude uh it's gonna be crazy you guys really gotta so this this one's just about participation but really you gotta really step up because i'm not going to be the only uh judge and it's it's ed Meyer's map you know so if we if it really comes down to it and we can't decide clearly which who's the winner we may bring in like a third person to judge um but yeah man i'm not going to be the only one judging here so uh you're gonna have some outside outside people coming in Got some new skin luck. New skin luck. Uh, first game on was Sally. Absolutely love these Tim Burton collabs. Obviously using Code Quantum Camper. Shout out Christian G. Sending me that sick clip. Getting the NSL. Um, also picked up Festival Lace today. Absolutely love the skin. GG's in the chat for Christian G. Coming in hot. Getting some sick skins. Getting a win. Luffy. You know him. You love him. Coming in with that code usage. Jamie OK in the house. Both on the stream last night. 
I might have stirred up a little a little something between them. If you know, you know. My bad. We're just trying to have fun here. I might. <laughs> Jamie dipped out of a, a game, mid-game, to come join us, I, which I respect that move. But also, you know, some people might have been a little salty about it. But, you know, we get wild, bro. We get wild. It's all good and fun, though. Um, Duck Butter uh, using the code for... Uh, Andy Fingerson. I actually also got this uh, this skin too. I haven't used him yet. I'm super stoked. Uh, yeah, shout out to Duck Butter too, picking up the edgiest of e-girls. Also, uh, shout out Dasha. Sent me a message. Uh, they got it too. Dasha Vu, uh, previous winner of the contest. Um, so yeah, guys, follow me on Twitter. Tag me anytime you use my code. Send me your freaking, your sweet clips. Okay. We'll, we'll show them on the show here. Uh, shout out Echo1982. Also picked up um, Teen Wolf. It's like a colorful Teen Wolf, dude. Andy Fingerson. It's a really good skin. I can't wait to use it. I saw, I've seen a couple clips. Um, have not been able to use it, though. Is there any other ones we got? Uh any other shout outs? Oh yeah, Cam Bradley picked up a festo. We talked about we talked about that. Oh yeah, Ming Jin picked up the fish fish person. We'll uh we'll go over that. Yeah, bro. Ooh, look at this. Dude, I'm telling you, Paul Peterson. They Oh, that's really good, dude. I'm telling you, you got a knack for this, bro. You gotta stick with it. Snazzy was saying that um, Epic Games used to do uh, like actual photography contests. I, guess, I don't know if they. Wow, that's so good, dude! Look at that. Wow. Whoa. She's got like a team of night hairs. This is so cool, bro. I'm just now seeing this for this for the first first time. I must have missed this. Uh. Yeah, I don't know. I think you see. Yeah, I was uh, I was busy doing stuff today. Um, Spirit Bomb, five five. One of my favorite games earlier this season with twelve kills. I think stuck the landing too. Let's check this out, dude. Spirit Bomb fifty five, coming in hot. This is epic, awesome right here. Oh, love it. Um, yeah. So, uh, oh yeah, 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 and then okay, last one. Cold Zone nine nine nine. Great photography, actually, from uh, from their games on the new season. Using that's the problem about buying a lot of skins. You just you don't have like time to use them all, or as much as you like. Really great photo with uh, Harley there. Like I just got Harley, and I, I want to use her. Oh, this one's good too. These are really good, dude. You guys are super talented. This is crazy. So yeah, give me a follow. I think that's about it, dude. Yeah, Wayne got new skin luck. Everyone's, you guys are so cool. This is crazy. Um, Let's keep going on the shop here. Billy's here. Billy's leaving in 1015. Dude, the, the new Billy Mythic is wild. It took a second to kind of figure out how to use it, but it is it is good. Um, Yeah, we don't really need to go over Billy. Pretty much. Wow, that looks really good on her. I like that. Um... Super good. You know, I mean, really, we'll just talk about this one more time. The big selling point. I mean, obviously, Billy is goaded, but the rap is so good. I've been using it nonstop. Uh, it's kind of like my go-to rap for spooky skins. Just looks super cool. Um, yeah, so grab that. Oh, I repositioned. We got to do OCD check here. Oh, yeah, Gentle Squirrel. Uh, oh, yeah, gentle shout out Gentle Squirrel picked up uh, Galaxy something. Wayne picked up Shadow Midas. Shout out. Um, ooh. Did you add this to the uh, thread? Pun, uh, Pajinek69. Add this to the thre the official thread so I don't miss it. These are sick. I want that marshmallow. Uh, oh, that's cool. That's actually dope. Sweeping out to the leaves because it's fall. Um, yeah, this one right here gent looks like Gentle Squirrel picked it up too. Whoa. Billy's getting wild in the background, dude. 
This skin right here. I may have to get this too. Dasha said that uh, they got it too. So, um, there's just there's 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 too much. There's too many good skins in the shop right now. It's actually insane, bro. Epic. Calm down, okay. Literally chill. You're gonna have to give me like some type of part time employment. Cause I got, how am I going to afford all these dude? Huh? What are you doing to me, dude? Festival Phaedra, you know, I've been wanting her and she's back. Oh my God, dude. I almost got emotional when I saw her. I was like, <laughs> just a little, it's a little bit. Both festival gals are here, dude. This is crazy. It's been 211 days. March 16th, February 1st, January 8th. It's been a while, bro. Don't do this, Don't do this to me again, Phaedra. Welcome home. Wow. So sick, dude. I am ecstatic right now. And let's not let's not sleep on the uh, the back bling here. You know that looks dope. Look at the teeth kind of moving around. The maw, bro, chill actually. Gosh dang, that's good. Let's check out bog stick. Ming Jin picked up bog stick. Really cool. Could be like a potentially like the fish people in Zelda. You know what I'm talking about? Maybe. I like it. Uh, night eye glow off. Night eye glow on. Ooh, I like. It's very cool. Oh, so I guess it glows at night. <laughs> Ghetto Lego, dude. Oh my God! Look at the Ghetto Lego on Bog Stick, dude. That's actually legit. Wait, can you run? Can you actually choose the Ghetto Lego? Okay, obviously the real Lego looks way better, but the so can you choose to be the Ghetto Lego in game? I've never actually tried it. I want to start. I'm gonna start and to, and hear me out about the Ghetto Legos. Unless they take them away, which I don't think they will. Having skins with Ghetto Legos, that's like a thing that that could be a thing to collect. I like the pink, uh, the pink hat up here, the pink beanie. And the coloring on the skin, it's very cool. Uh, obviously, the actual Lego is really, really dope. This would be a really cool, like, physical minifig. Like, really cool. However, let's not sleep on the Ghetto Lego, okay? <laughs> uh, pretty dope. Guys, what's up with Baba Yaga? Like, this has to be... What? Okay. How do I say this... How do I say this without upsetting you? Because so many people are like ecstatic that this skin is back in game. And I'll say 10 out of 10 design. Like everything, like she, I, I don't know. What is this? Yeah, is it a grandma? It's got to be. Do you hear the sound of chicken legs? Part of the Coven Fresh set. Uh, she's got warts, bro. What? Like, this is actually scary. Now, like I said, 10 out of 10 design. They knocked it out of the park. She looks so cool. But also, you want to stare at those warts while you're playing, <laughs> while you're playing her. Okay. You know what I? You know what I want to stare at when I play? I don't even have to show you. You know what I'm talking about. You want you want to stare at warts? That's cool. 
if that's what you're into oh that backling is sick though dude legitimately the auric the raven oh my god how about this hear me out model four listen up the raven back bling with raven team leader might be kind of cool what do you think about that this back bling is legitimately oh my god i can't i can't, does war i can't do that i can't do it i can't look at those warts dude Again, phenomenal skin. And it would be like one of those ones that's really cool to have in your collection. When was Bobby? Is Bobby Yaga is probably only here for a spooky, spooky season. Three forty. It's been three hundred forty-six days. Yeah. So this is a October exclusive. Now. So I, I, I want to make it clear that I'm not talking crap about Baba Yaga, but I just, I just, me personally, I, I could, I could not ever run this skin. I legitimately could never. But I get it. Oh, those, okay, we got to stop looking at her. Those, those, <laughs> confirm Ghetto Lego. The Ghetto Lego looks nice. Can we just, can we just... Look, they even put warts on the get or on the official Lego. <laughs> That's crazy, and I know some of you tagged me that you're getting them, getting her. Oh yeah, she's got like chicken legs. It's like uh, voodoo type of stuff, I assume. Again, ten out of ten design. I get it, but I but it's just like a personal hang up. Now, how about this? Hear me out. Let's give Baba Yaga a edgy e-girl variant. You know how they release Ruby and then like they give her a new variant like a year later and then the year after that, they give another one. They do that with some other skins. Let's do that. But like, let's give her like, you know, uh, a prequel version. Baba Yaga, the early days variant. Pre-wart Baba Yaga. How about that? Let's give us that variant. Not a bad idea. Just saying. Epic. Listen. Listen up. Guys, Festival Phaedra, I can't understand why you don't have her in your locker. This is insane, bro. I know a girl that, or used to, that low-key kind of looked like that. Shout out everyone who... Everyone who gets the whole edgy e-girl thing, I know some of you don't. I get it. That's fine. Um, but shout out to everyone that does, okay? And there's edgy e-boys, okay? Not many. There are not many. In fact, I would, I'll, I'll argue there needs to be more edgy e-boy representation in Fortnite. I'll say it right now. Okay? There's like four. We need a few more, okay? Shadow Midas is one. So you got one in the shop. Okay, you get one right now. You got one right now. I might even pick him up. He's so sick. I really like that skin. It's dope. What do you think? Uh, Skeletera, I know a few of you picked her up. Super, super good. Um, Seth is still here. Headlock. It's one of those skins, really good, but there's just way too much other amazing new and rare stuff coming out. <laughs> Why? It's spooky season. Why are you releasing the, the sweat skins? It doesn't make sense. I mean, it really doesn't. Why are the sweat skins back? I don't know. Oh, you know what? Aren't they doing like a new... Isn't is there a new reload season or something coming out? Maybe that's why. Are they updating reload? Maybe that's why. It's so funny that they just know. They just their kit they cater to their uh What is this guy's this guy what is what is this? What is this? Look at that mustache, bro. Ew. <laughs> uh, okay. And, and I'm happy about this. 
what I'm about to say because I prefer female skins the girls get the girls in the game get way better designs and more attention than the guys and I, and I'm happy about that but I get it not everyone want, wants to run the girl skins okay it's not fair <laughs> they're just like hey here's like 10 unbelievably amazing female skins here's a guy with the worst mustache you've ever seen that's all you get <laughs> it's wild bro but luckily i'm into stuff like festival lace and there's like a hundred skins out there like this festival lace the festival lace is an 800 skin okay confirmed get a lego as well you're absolutely insane if you don't own festival i mean she's just like a cool like rock punk chick even if you know what i mean i mean she's just quintessential ripped fishnet stockings face paint low-key clown like like she can go to the metal show and she might be at the gathering gathering of the juggalos okay she's di she's diversible Diver she can diversify a little bit okay she's great 800 this is the 800 skin I can't believe I, I've passed on her so many times, dude. She's coming home. Low-key, crappy tattoos. Every edgy e-girl has to have like 30% of their tattoos are atrocious. <laughs> that's, a, that's just a must, okay? I love it. I, I'm, I'm so stoked. Uh, random, the mecha team leader is back. But that being said, Mega Team Leader is very cool. And the Lego is also cool. So I get it. Um, Poise Playmaker, moving on. Ferocious Velocity. Dead Nightmare was saying that they wanted this. Uh, was it Jamie OK that picked this up? This skin is legitimately cool. Like... It's it would just it's just gonna look really sick to to freaking stare at that while you're playing, you know what I mean? I always I always think about this view. What are you looking at while you play? Is it gonna be fun to look at the entire match? This skin one hundred percent. Let's do a deep dive in this, dude. Speed demon, literally. Part of the Ferocious Velocity set introduced in Chapter 4, Season 1. Oh, my Lanta. The detail is amazing. The glowing, whatever the inside, just phenomenal design. Uh, unsheath the momentum pickaxe from the Soul Shroud, a back bling, when both are equipped. Ooh, it's one of those ones when they... Oh, I see. Okay. So, look at that. The, oh, that's... Okay. All right. Somebody who owns this skin or who just got it, give me give me your honest opinion or even send me video if you can. There's no way that this is not distracting. It's very cool. Don't get me wrong, but this glowing and it's like shimmering like bro. That would get so distracting during the game. It might just be me. I may get distracted easily uh, about that, you know, that size. That's yeah. There's no way I would. I I couldn't do it. That's just way too distracting. But tell me, send me footage. Is that distracting? That being said, it is very cool looking. I just I just uh, realistically, really really good rap. Wow, that's cool. Whoa, it's too super look how tiny it is. <laughs> um yeah, that's just that's pretty sick. It's very cool. Reminds me of like a I don't know. Like a PS3 era bad guy to like a, a one of those games. You know what I'm talking about. Super cool. Snow patroller. This guy has to have a ghetto Lego, dude. First of all, do we need to like legitimately freak out right now that this is a 
I don't care that this is t reactive. Whoa, we're touching the we're touching the darkness right now. Calm down. Get a Lego confirmed. Twelve hundred for a skin that has a mask on and doesn't have a mask off. Ooh, he's got skeleton hands. That's crazy, dude. Uh, this is what I'm telling you. Would would <laughs> they do not care about male skin? They give you like, they give you like sick stuff like this. That's like non gender specific skins. It's just some cool like ghost demon thing, whatever it is. And they give you like the most amazing edgy e girl, beautiful female skins, and then <laughs> snow patroller. <laughs> I'm okay with it though. Um, I mean, there, that being said, you get Midas, you know, you got one, you get one, um, Arctica, uh, <laughs> objectively way better. So this is the female counterpart to homeboy. Way better, dude. I mean, it just looks like it's even more detailed and like the the back bling looks way better, dude. Like you would actually. <laughs> oh, my God. Uh, I was looking at chill count earlier. This is a cool it's a cool skin. You could. Uh, yeah, it's not it's not bad. I, I don't think I've ever seen these before. Let's look it up. Chill count. Shout out Fortnite.gg. 149 days ago. Oh, wait. Hold on. Yeah, May 17th. Okay. Um. Yeah, so it looks like there's like a whole... Okay. Oh, it's one of those ones where there's like... A bunch of different guy versions. A bunch of girl versions. Um. Super good. I think it's, that's a solid 800 skin. You know what I mean? It's interesting. They just brought one back. Get a Lego? No. It's interesting. They just brought one back. Uh, solid design. 800. I think it's cool. No variant. Nothing. It's just, you know, it's a good skin. Uh, Scrap Night Jewels. I know a couple people attacked me. She's really good, dude. Look at that. Look at that. The, the... The design's insane, bro. I might have to get this. I the only jewels I have is beach jewels. Oh, look at the earrings, dude. Oh, this is sick, bro. Yeah. This is really good. Ooh. That's so cool. Let's check out the uh the cape. Um actually pretty cool see here's the thing is like i like it when mm, it's actually really cool the top of the cape right here looks super sick the design right here dope that's nice i really like that um let's finish this shop here and then we'll do the uh the giveaways the giveaway and then brute i you know i brought i got brute gunner brute gunner is such a good 800 skin Still haven't used her. There's just I I got her at a time when so much stuff is coming out. Sure. Uh, yeah. So I can't use it. I can't wait to use her. And then uh, let's not sleep on committed. Um, I can't remember the name of the artist who's in this song. But finally, look, they're doing the synced emotes where the, so they have you can actually see what it's like. Perfect. Um. And I've seen some, I think Plushy posted some uh, photography uh, of that emote. So very, very cool. And then let's not sleep on uh, the new Lego pack. Oh, that I already purchased. Um, I want to show you how cool this guy looks. And then we'll look at the, uh, the, the pass is really good. Ooh, spooky. Um, so, I mean, the builds are really cool. 
Uh, the vibe when you watch this is sick, too. Isn't it cool? So, I mean, yeah, it's it's definitely got a, it's got a cool vibe. I heard that the Lego update was kind of non-existent. I don't think that there was much changed on the map. Um, so that potentially could be disappointing for hardcore Lego. Lego, Lego. Uh, oh, there's, yeah. So there's some really cool stuff in here. Um, and I know there are a few people that watch this that are super into Lego and in Rocket Racing too. Which, uh, oh, hello. Uh, I don't know what happened. Oh, I literally just, oh my God. Wow. <laughs> I'm going to have to watch the playback on that. I somehow literally just turned, uh, I'd like, I was like, wait, what just happened? Okay. Everything's fine. <laughs> um, that was really weird. Okay. Everything's fine, guys. We're going to survive. So yeah, th this is, this is all really cool. This is just a vibe watching all this, dude. or uh, chilling in here. This is going to be spooky. The Ruin of Rue. Uh, yeah, so super dope, uh, super dope builds. Why is my, f look, my frames per second are like 70 to 80 frames per second. And then as soon as I spin this, 25, 24. It's very weird. Um, He's cool, dude. Uh, What's his name? I can't remember. It's like uh, Fangerson, Andy Fangerson. How do you look at the non Lego version when you have Lego selected? Is that possible? The Lego, look how cool the Lego looks. It's popping. Oh, Nightmare is actually sick too. Um, let's look at this. Oh, there he is. He's cool, dude. Why is he on fire right now, bro? You need to chill. Like, somebody put that out. What is going on? Why is he on fire? <laughs> uh, okay. I don't I don't know why he's on fire. How do I turn that off? It's very weird. Uh, he's really good. I'm I'm getting feedback too that uh he's a really good skin. I can't wait to use him. Though that that's actually really dope. That design. I mean, you're almost gonna not want to use a backling to look at that tail. The tail, the tail looks really good too. Sometimes I'm kind of hung up on tails. I'm not a fan of them, but I do like that tail. That's nice. Uh yeah. This is a solid design. I like the 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 colors. The colors just pop, dude. The shoes look cool. He's got like a Teen Wolf vibe. Uh, for me, it's just, it's just a no brainer. So yeah, that's about it before we do the, uh, the giveaway here. Okay. I think that's it, right? Yeah. We're done with the shop, bruh. Let me know if you're going to get anything. Um, there's so much dude, so much. It's crazy. Let's do the dang giveaway right now, right now. Spin that freaking wheel right now. <laughs> Taking a tone, dude. Chill, bruh. We're going to turn this car over. To turn this car around right now. You spin that wheel right now. That's what I was getting that. that turn. The, I'm going to turn this car around right now vibe with you guys. Uh, so the question was, what was your favorite pickaxe specifically from... A, a battle pass that came out in chapter five. So it could be uh, season one, season two, season three, season four. Doesn't matter. But it's specifically, you had to tell me, and there's no wrong answer. You had to tell me what your favorite pickaxe from any battle pass this chapter. Okay. Shout out Eric Herrera, the OG. 
My favorite pickaxe from Chapter 5 Battle Pass would have would have to be Doom Blade. Huge a Doom fan, and green is my favorite color, so it's just perfect for me. I couldn't have said it better myself. Uh, Doom Blade was legitimately also one of my favorites. Uh, Captain America's Shield, for sure good. Um, the Magneto one, okay. Um, yeah, maybe it was all right. Oh, we got another, yeah, okay. Uh, Russ Wrecking Axe, that was a decent one, pretty good. Uh, Assaultron Blade, a bunch of people, I can't even remember what that one was. Assaultron, oh yeah, this one is good. Uh, this is the uh, T60, this is a really solid one. Um, you know what across the board though, a lot, and it's one I said too, was um, Snake's, uh, Snake's Knife. And it's such a it's such a um, simple design, but it's really good. I think even Muffin Man said they use it when they uh, are getting sweaty playing uh, playing ranked or reload. Uh, this this is one. I mean, it's just it's clean. It's very small. It's great. You can get sweaty with it. It like I mean, it's cool to use too. You know. Um. So I would say practically, this is probably the best. But then if I had to pick a favorite, like fun one, yeah, like the Doom, the Doom one would probably be my favorite. But um, yeah, you guys had some really cool, um, really cool answers here. Oh, sheesh. Lyra, chapter two, season six, pack. Technically, she, she could come back. Well, we need that one. Putting that in the wish list. Yep. <laughs> uh let's spin the dang wheel dude uh so once again no wrong answers okay we got 95 names on here okay all the ogs all the regulars um we have ncaa model four i saw e Crail on there uh we have wayne we got everyone. Dead Nightmare. Everyone's on here. Jamie. I, Jamie gets forgotten sometimes. I have to put I have to put him on twice. Uh pathetic, I see pathetic person. Everyone's on here, bro. Everyone who matters. Shout out Sim. Sim's on here. Sim Sanin. JC. Poojinick. Poojinick. Let's do this, dude. For 1,000 V-Bucks, who will be the winner? Oh my Lanta. Congratulations, potentially, Ronald Seuss. Let's see. Did you correctly answer? I feel like, weren't you in the uh, stream last night? Ron oh my goodness. Roneld. Ron. Eld, Sue's fave picks at pickaxe are uh, TMNT nunchucks underrated. Guys, what's going on here? Are you, are you serious? Fave pickaxe are TMNT nunchucks underrated. Also, they go with way more skins than you would think. Please tell me, Ron, that you all additionally answered something from the battle pass. Guys, we have to stick. We have to stick to the rules here. Okay, the the question was specifically, and I made it so specific. I'm not getting mad, but I'm just telling you we have to stick to the rules. We may have to pick another name. Ronald, I'm sorry. I'm gonna please tell me you answered. You did another comment. That's the only one, dude. I'm sorry, you are not eligible. You had to specifically tell me. Not just what your favorite pickaxe was, but I, and I said it several times, what was your specific, specifically, what was your favorite pickaxe from a battle pass that came out in chapter five, season one, two, three, or four? I'm not mad at you. I'm just disappointed. <laughs> and I'm pretty sure you were, were you the Ronald that was in, I've seen your, I keep, I've, and this bums me out. This is the second time it's happened, guys. You have to, I, I tell you specifically the question you have to answer that there's no wrong answers to unless so no wrong answers in the sense that 
it's your decision what what your favorite pickaxe was from the chapter but it has to be one of those okay let's double check ronald i'm sorry fave pickaxe are tmnt nunchucks underrated i will uh, i 100 agree with that and the tmnt um the nunchucks mikey's nunchucks are probably top uh, at least top 10 for me they look amazing with bruno mars shout out was it borderline peso who who came up with that uh setup uh oh we got to pick again i'm sorry ronald we have to stick to the rules okay that's it we're getting another name i'm sorry ladies and gentlemen i tell you what here's the redemption ronald if we land in your name again i'll let you win here we go because it's actually insane if you if you twice in a row it's happened who's going to be the new winner or will ronald land if we will we ran land on ronald again this is going to get insane dude here we go ladies and gentlemen who will be the winner of 1000 v bucks Oh, OG in the house. Congratulations. Sam Sanin 2352. You have just won potentially. Oh, Sam, if you didn't free Sam, please, please tell me. I, I they always answer correctly. Finally finished watching the video after being so busy. LMAO. Had to start it multiple times. Stun knife. Also has to be my favorite for how clean it is. Also pick axe how I uh, reach unreal. Yes, Sam, you finally won. Congratulations. I'm so happy for you. Honestly, that's amazing. I'm getting choked up. <laughs> Send me a message on uh, Twitter. You have just won 1,000 V-Bucks. I love it when the uh, the regulars win. I really do. Send me a message on Twitter. We'll get you that code, bud. And you also get the bird call emote when you uh, redeem this. That's so cool. Wowie, wowie, wow. How neat is that, dude? What a great time we have here. So cool. Let's look at... I don't think that there was much. Oh, you know what? We do want to. We do want to just look out how how cool Alexa is again. We do want to do that actually. Just like I said in the beginning, there's what's the point of even doing these freaking videos anymore after specifically the variant right here, dude? Huh? Oh, you seen that meme? Oh, oh. Wow. Why is this so good? Also, the back bling. The pickaxe. Hold on, we gotta look at the wrap. I've never I actually haven't seen the wrap. Oh, that's cool. I mean, if I have to get Fortnite complaining about anything, I would say I, you know, I probably won't ever use the pickaxe. It's cool. It might grow on me. We'll see. I don't like the double-handed ones. I like um, one-handed. Uh, or like, you know, when you have like the the size, you know? I don't, I don't really like that. I like the two-handed one like that or like a one-handed like knife type of thing. That's just me though. And can we just say, I know it's just played out at this point but total glow up from this and it's wild how how good how much better fortnite has gotten at the uh the animated skins like that's i'm sure when it, you know in t december 2nd 2020 when this came out people were like whoa dude it looks like a cartoon that's cool but now it's like we just have just insane stuff i mean princess lexa looks good too but this is just, oh my God, bro. I can't even handle it. I can't even handle it sometimes. It's just wild. Um, Gentle Squirrel says, which skin is better to buy? Midas? 
uh, what is it, T88 or something? Oh, IG11. Uh, Moff, I have Moff or her. Ah, uh, that's a hard one. Moff is really good. I really do like Moff Gideon. If I had to pick, though, right now, I would say it's between Midas or Galaxy Girl. If you can't, I would say get Galaxy Girl and Midas if you can. But if you had to pick one, I would almost go with Midas, dude. Because there's, I, I think just, I, I don't have enough cool skins that look like this. And he, he's just phenomenal. Phenomenal design. I, If I had to pick out of those four, I would say, I mean... Don't get me wrong, Galaxy Girl is really cool, but I just I, I I would I have a lot of really cool female skins. I don't have a lot of cool male skins, so I would uh, personally, if I had to pick out of those four, yeah, I would go Midas. That's wild, picking an edgy e boy over an edgy e girl, dude. Whoa, whoa. Um, people are saying the chainsaw is overpowered. I don't think so because you can just jetpack up or just jump away with his shiri claws very quickly uh i don't think he's overpowered um also the uh these look really cool the um she venom should i should we get both or should we get just one if you had to pick which one would you get that's what i want to know she venom or agony i think i might get agony but you could get you could you do have the you have the um option no no no, no she venom because you have the option of getting sweaty or camping with this skin yeah if you have to pick i'll probably most likely get both but if you had to pick between the two i would probably i would go she venom the pickaxes do look kind of nasty i'll probably never use them We'll see, though. This back bling also looks disgusting, but I like it. <laughs> the veiny. Yeah, these are really cool. These are really cool skins. Oh, yeah, this is... Uh, oh, dude, shout out Borderlands tree guy right here. That's the, that's the tree guy that I was talking crap about. My bad. Sorry. Um, also, shout out iTalk is edgy e-gang for sure. I highlighted these two. iTalk knows what's up, dude. Uh, oh yeah, the Paradigm uh, OG style got added. Um, looks like Rocket Racing might officially be dying, unfortunately. Oh! Let's talk about that. <sighs> Batman is potentially coming back. I think the Batman pack has been updated and I will potentially return and we will potentially return to the item shop. Um, and then I guess Black Adam's emote... I think got updated so it looks like we may be getting some d ski skins back so that's the thing is that it, I, I know i've been talking about getting uh, i just got harley quinn and the batman the the um batman armor suit one um and then somebody sent me the code very graciously for uh batman who laughs but all, that being said like if you're gonna so with this announcement, I would hold off if you're gonna if you're gonna drop serious money on any DC skins, I would hold off. However, the Batman Batman Who Laughs skin is you can easily get for like ten to fifteen dollars right now, which is essentially the same price it would be in the shop. So if you want to get that code now, you're it's you know, it's not gonna be much of a difference. So don't don't fret on that. If you get this graphic novel that has the code for Harley Quinn and the Batman in it and a couple other cosmetics, it's like 20 bucks. So it's 20 bucks. So you get the two skins, a few other cosmetics and this graphic novel. That's actually, I think a better deal than it would be if you were buying it just in the shop. Stick to those. I know some people are dropping serious money on like the Joker pack and might come back, dude. So I would hold off on that for real, for real. Um, there, there's just the new skins coming out. We got to talk about um, Sid X uh, Raven Team Leader, dude. They're doing like a, a mashup. Is it a mashup or is like some people are saying like, dude, I think was Raven Team Leader Sid the whole time. 
uh what is going on with that also bro what it this is like the cobalt snowfoot is the um ps plus skin i think i think what's up with that i don't want to like speak negatively about something but huh let me know what you think about that oh yeah then um so the oh Kir- kirian this is the male version of kira okay what do you think about that i think you know at at first i just saw like the mask and i was like okay pass but i don't know he's kind of got it he's got to go he's got a cool vibe um i like that that white and red one is really clean i'm not crazy about this this color right here but i'll say uh that white and red one is super clean so not bad not bad and you can do mask off uh phantom guff is coming for sure we already have the pumpkin king okay this is sid raven team sid crazy dude hauntingly cheerful part of the scare bear set whoa so it's like a it's like a sid raven team leader mashup model ford what do you think about this anyone who mains rtl are you i think it looks great personally i think this looks absolutely fire i love sid i recently got sid um I think this is a really, really good skin. But I want to know from all the hardcore RTL fans. What do you think? And it's okay if you don't like it. Um, I just want, I want to know your honest opinion. I, th- I think it looks phenomenal. And the fact that you can do the hood up, hood, up, hood down. I'm 100% getting this skin. Let me know if you're going to get it. Especially if you're an RTL skin. Rotten Penny? Kind of cool, honestly. I may actually legitimately have to pick her up. Uh, she has a really cool... I don't know if this video is going to show it, but she has a really cool pickaxe too. Um, so yeah, we can we can skip ahead on that. Yeah, those are all the back blings. There's some really cool stuff coming out. Um, oh yeah, that's it right there. We'll show you that pickaxe and then we'll, uh, we'll get going here. What's the question going to be, dude? What is the question to win one? Oh my God! I just, I just, I just love her so much. Um. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Edward Scissorhands is coming. We'll just, we'll look that up on uh, Fortnite.gg. So good, dude. I, I did say that the face is kind of hanging me up, and it still kind of is. Uh. But that being said, the suit, the suit, and everything, it's just so phenomenal. It's so good uh low-key like robert smith from the cure uh vibes so that's gonna be super fun uh it's gonna be interesting to see him hold weapons we're gonna have to wait and see what that looks like with the scissor hands uh okay that makes sense the back bling because that's in the movie it's been so long since i've seen the movie oh scissor hands pickaxe so that's gonna be kind of like wolverine very cool uh, and then we got the nice little emote here, which is a synced one. That's fun. And then Edward's six string hands. <laughs> also cool. Get ready for people to complain about this. The, the guitar is driving up the price. So lots of really cool stuff to look forward to. Um, What is the question? Oh, we got. Uh, okay. I'll think of a question while we watch this. I'm going to turn off my literally oh yeah, yeah I exported it. Uh, I'm going to show you a clip from the I'm going to show you a clip from the live stream. Why well, you got to watch at least part of the playback, dude. It's so fun. We had a great time. We had a and you know what? It's just crazy to think that like not too long ago, like literally no one was watching my live stream. Literally zero people. In fact, one person was watching it and it was me logged in on another account to make it look like somebody else was watching. <laughs> And then one day, Eric Barrera came in and started hanging out. And then a couple other people. And then a couple of, a couple other people. Okay. So everyone who's there in the early days, bro, I'll never forget you, honestly. The fact that we hit over a thousand views yesterday and had, you know, uh, at one point, like 80 people watching the stream. It's insane. That's crazy, dude. 
I'm so grateful for everyone. I really am. Like, truthfully. Um, if you were there, even just there for 10 minutes, or you're there the whole time, uh, honestly, I really, really appreciate you. Oh, oh it's the Saw TV. So this is right when um, we dropped at Freaky, the Freaky, Freaky Fields. And uh, Jamie found the Saw TV. And the rest is history. This is this is a crazy clip, dude. Oh, anyway, it's the Saw TV. Watch this. Oh, Where you can uh, investigate it. What? What? Oh, is that like one of the quests? Ah! Bro, he freaking jumped oh, out of no. the TV. What? Wait, I'm going to die. Dude, what? Billy's oh, legit that? insane. That? That oh, my God. What? Me. Dude, he's going to... What the heck? Is that what? a real... What? I have no weapons, by the way. Dude, damage. he does. This is great. I'm actually going to get eliminated by him. What the heck? What is this? Oh Dude. My God, oh, what? my God. I'm dead. What, what is this? Billy that's NPC insane. squad wipe, bro. super fast. What? Yo, that's, that is scary. Oh, I killed him. Billy oh, NPC yeah. oh, almost oh, squad wiped us, dude. Bro, isn't that insane? Wait. Are you kidding me right now, dude? Dude, we got sweats coming. Yeah, 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 yeah. This is wild. Oh, we're screwed. We're screwed. I have zero guns, by the way. You're going to have to carry me. I have zero guns either. <laughs> Let's just dip. Nice. I'm dipping. I'm dipping. I'm dipping. I I'm still have no I'm weapons, dead. dude. And I, look, I have 36 strong. mats. Oh, yeah. I'm out of here. This all happened live, by the way. If you, if you were there, thank you. You know, shh, 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 it was shh, fun. Shh. Okay, sorry. You good, going? I'm so screwed right now. There's nothing I can you. do. I, I can just literally hope that he doesn't see me. Yeah. Hey, bro. Just don't. <laughs> just don't do it. <laughs> no. Just don't do it, dude. No, bro. That's actually crazy, bro. Chill. <laughs> Chill, dude. Nah, dude. Just don't. Do, no. Please don't do it. No. Please no. don't do it. Oh. <laughs> no, dude. Chill. I've got. I. <laughs> I've got the Billy Bomb. The Billy Bomb is coming towards me. Wow, bro. No, dude. dude, that's crazy, actually, dude. Bro is in a Le LeBron James and a P and a P and a Peel Balloon skin, bro. Get a freaking life, dude. Get a life, dude. Peel Balloon took me out, dude. At least wear something kind of Halloweenish. You know what For I mean? Real. Even if it's like a girl with like pale skin and black hair, that's fine. Something kind of, you know, anything, dude. LeBron <laughs> and Pilverine. Come on, dude. Bro, really? And I, I'll stick. I'll, st I'll. I will stand by that. I'll stand by that. Okay. Look, I know when you're live, things get heated. You might say things that you don't necessarily mean, or might want to take back. I don't take that back. I st I'm I'm still 100% for that, okay. You're wearing a pilverine when Fortnite on the day Fortnite mirrors dropped. You don't have just I don't know something minutely spooky. You're wearing LeBron. Okay, you know what? I'll even give you pilverine. At least it's like. You know, out of this world. You're wearing a LeBron. I'll give the star the the stormtrooper. That's f I guess it's all black. That's fine. I, not really, but it's not as bad as LeBron. Huh? What? Bro. So I'm saying our lives are fun, dude. You gotta watch that, dude. Um, so that's about it. The question for today. I'm running out of questions. Give me ideas for questions. The question is, to get your name on the Wheel of Names tomorrow. Whoa, yes, I am gonna keep playing. Uh, what is, we did pickaxe, we did skin, we did glider, we did not do back playing okay so we're just gonna we're going through the whole the whole battle the whole chapter five battle pass 
set here, okay? And I'm going to make this, even though I made it, I've made it very clear each time to, okay, listen up. If you want to win 1,000 V-Bucks tomorrow, okay? Pay attention. There's no wrong answer in the sense that it's up to your decision as long as you answer this question correctly as in, so this is the question that you have to answer. What is your favorite back? I'm, am I touching the darkness? <sighs> I'm grateful to play this game. I'm grateful you're watching here. Thank you. The question to win 1,000 V-Bucks tomorrow is... What is your favorite back bling that came out during chapter five in a battle pass? Okay, your what is your favorite battle pass back bling that came out during chapter five, season one, season two, season three, or season four? It's up to you. Now, you could say, and I know someone's going to say this. Wilson's my favorite back bling from chapter five. Might be my favorite as well, but you will not win 1,000 V-Bucks if you put that because guess what? Oh, Wilson. <coughs> Although Wilson, one of the best back blings from chapter five is not a battle pass back bling. Therefore, you will not be eligible to win, okay? You might even say, oh, the Pilverine plush. That's one of my favorites. If you say that, you also will not win 1,000 V-Bucks. However, if you say Meowtooth plush, you will be eligible to, to win 1,000 V-Bucks. Why is that? That's right. Because that is a battle pass back bling, okay? So, any battle pass back bling, it's your decision, all right? Is it uh, Pip-Boy? Pip-Boy's pretty good. Not going to lie. Um... That was a good one. What else do we have? Peabody's was pretty good. You know what's crazy? I've never used the Peabody skin. Have you? Um, no, technically this is not... This is a mini pass and it came out during chapter five. That's not a battle pass. So. That is legitimately... This is one of my... Like overall chapter five. The skull and cross swords. I still use it. Uh, it looks really good on the machinist, the like standard default version. Um, you could do co cozy conch. I'm gonna have to really think about this. What well, my favorite uh, chapter five battle pass uh, back bling was, huh? You know what, Pinata Brian, pretty good. Oh, you know what? Oh, that's so easy for me. I forgot Radicat. I use I used this so much. I used Radicat for like. Two, at least season one and season two, almost exclusively. I use this a lot. That's Hope's, uh, Hope's back bling. Yeah, that's a really, really good one. Okay. So tell me your favorite chapter five battle pass back bling specifically. Okay. And once you give me that information, once you tell me in the comments what your favorite one is, then you will be eligible to win 1,000 V-Box. All right, that about does it. All right, I feel like it's a long one. I don't even know how long we're, we're talking for, but um, it was good. This is a good episode. Um, Mephisto, oh, I saw the apartment today. Turns out I kind of know one of the people that lives there. It would be a roommate situation. Uh, so hopefully I get it because I got a good vibe. Uh, they seem cool. Um, we have to, like, I don't know them, but we, but I know of them and I've seen them before and I talked and then like, we have tons of friends in common. So it's super cool. So wish me luck. Hopefully I get it. Uh, it's the right price. It's the right location. Um, so we'll see. Uh, I'll let you know about that. That's what's going on in my life. Mephisto. Are you going to pick them up? Uh, pumpkin King and Sally. I think it's, uh, to me, it's a no brainer. Uh, Billy's still here. We got the edgy E-boy. We got Wart Lady. Festival Phaedra and Festival Lace, among others. What are you going to get? One more time, please use code Quantum Camper as your supported creator code. Uh, drop me a like and subscribe. 
and I will see you tomorrow. Bye-bye. Wow. <laughs>